challenge epic fail. Because these things will change. Can you feel it? Hello everyone, it is Monday and I'm Kelsey, so I'm back. So here was what happened last week. Um, I answered all the questions, I made a video, I uploaded it to YouTube, it said it's crash, and then it never appeared on the channel and I didn't notice it until the next day. So there was nothing I could do about it. I couldn't just upload it the next day because that would have thrown everyone else off. So I'm very, very sorry about that. So here I am, I'm back. And I'm going to start answering questions. Charlie's question was, if you could have dinner with any celebrity dead or alive, who would it be? Um, I think I would have dinner with either Taylor Swift or Hugh Laurie. Not together. <laughs> But yes, I love them very, very much. So two of my favorite celebrities, and I think we would have some great conversations. I would love to learn more about them, what their life is like, and their past and everything. And I think I love them very much. I think we would have a great time. Oh, also, Ellen DeGeneres. I think I would have a very nice time having dinner with her, because she is very cool. Catherine's question was, do you like camera too? Um, I've never had tamasu, but if it has coffee in it, I probably wouldn't like it. I'm not a coffee person. I'm a tea. I love tea. My British love is tea. So, <laughs> but yeah, I love tea. Um, coffee, not so much. So, I don't think I would like it, but if I ever do try it, I will be so let you know. Dawn's question was, who is your favorite Harry Potter character and or movie? I've never read the Harry Potter book. I never got into it. I, I tried reading the first one in like third grade and I didn't like it. I just I just I didn't like it at all. I couldn't get into it. So I gave up on those. But I have seen the first movie and I absolutely love it. They're adorable when they were younger. So I would say the first movie is my favourite. <laughs> the same question was, what is the one food you would eat for the rest of your life? You'll never get sick of it and you wouldn't gain any weight. Um, I don't, I don't know. I think I'm looking too far into this, but if you would die, you probably would die if you only ate one food. So, I'm going to say water. I will definitely have to have water because that keeps you alive. I have to go with Captain on that one, even though she's going to apparently punch my face in or something. I was very nervous when I saw her video, but whatever. But, I know, right? Anyway, but, so yes, I would definitely say water. And... Um, my favorite food is grapes, so I'd probably say grapes, so I, I could live on grapes, and I would also have to go with Lauren and say Pop-Tarts, I love Pop-Tarts, I have one almost every morning. So yeah, that was cute. Lauren's challenge was dress up like a Disney character. I couldn't find anything, I didn't know, my favorite Disney character is Belle, Belle's adorable, she's my favorite, I love her. But I couldn't find anything for any of the Disney characters, so I got my my mini mouse ears that my aunt Pam got me from um, Disneyland when I was little. So I'm going to be mini mouse because <laughs> she's my favorite. I, I love mini. I had a mini mouse bed when I was little, and I just I love mini mouse. So oh here I am, mini mouse challenge, yeah. Kelly's question was, if you could trade places with a character from a TV show or movie, who would you choose and why? Um, I think I would choose Jenny Humphrey from Gossip Girl, because she has that whole internship for uh, Blair's mom, and for, I think it's Blair's mom, and that is so cool, and I mean, honestly, that'd be awesome. And also, she had that thing with Nate, she did it too, so, so I would choose her. <laughs> and either her or um, Alex from Wizards of Waverly Place, because this is so funny. I just love the little sarcastic remarks she's always making and she's funny and stuff. I know. Calvin's question was, have you ever had someone that you look up to disappoint you? Yeah, I'm going to have to go with Catherine and say Michael Phelps. Michael was a little disappointed. Actually, I was a little more than a little disappointed because he's awesome. And whatever. But good life. But people that I literally know that I look up to. Um, I know my mom and my dad are my biggest role models and my voice teacher. And they've never, you know, let me down or anything. And they always 
have my relationship to mind and everything. So I don't no one I really look up to in my regular life has really ever disappointed me. I've been lucky I think. Lauren's question was, what is your favorite movie? Okay. My I have a couple favorite movies. My favorite movie is Uptown Girls with Dakota Fanning and uh, Brittany Murphy. I absolutely love that movie. It's adorable. I could watch it like over and over again. I love the Pirates of the Caribbean movies. They're just hilarious and they're crazy. I love like the acting and everything. And they're very cute. I love that movie. I love those movies. They're awesome. Um, um, and A Cinderella Story. I love it. I haven't seen the new one. Uh, with Selena Gomez, uh, but I can just bet it's amazing. So, I have to see that. That's one thing on my list. And the mission is really good. I can't remember the action, but it's an amazing movie. It's like this lady, and she keeps having premonitions that her husband is going to die, and it, she tries to change it and fix it so that it doesn't happen, and it's just awesome. It's, it's so cool. I, just, I love that kind of stuff. Um, and Hide and Seek um, with Dakota Fanning and Robert De Niro. It's Oh my gosh, half of it. If you like scary movies, if you like scary movies, you have to see it. That's like one of the only scary movies I can take because I've seen it so many times. I don't get scared anymore. Well, I mean, I kind of do. But there's only certain, there's only like a couple parts that I get scared. But I know what's coming, so I'm not scared. <laughs> but yeah, that movie is awesome. It's kind of scary, but it's awesome. I recommend it. Yeah. So, my favorite movies. Um... Christine asks, what time do you usually wake up in the morning? What I do is I set my alarm for 5.55 so that I hit my alarm. So I hit, I hit the snooze button so I wake up at 6.05 in the morning. Which is a good time. Um, except when I have homework. When I have, when I have homework or test study for, that I haven't finished studying for and I just want to do a little more or something, I get up at like 5.55. No. And then I get up at like 5.45 or something. And then I go sleep in 6.15, somewhere around there. Easy 6.05. <laughs> so yeah, those are the questions. Those are the questions of the week. Uh, my question is, what is your favorite magazine? Like, uh, People, Us, Weekly, Teen Vogue, Vogue, Seventeen. Teen, I think there's a Teen People. That might have gone away. Uh, yeah, so what is your favorite magazine? Mine is, it's a toss-up between Teen Vogue and Seventeen. I think those prescriptions have ended. I'm very sad. But I don't know what I'm going to get. So, I hope I get another answer. <laughs> Ooh, and Popstar. Popstar always has the best teen news on Celebrity. This has, like, the best teen news and stuff. So, yeah. So, here's my question and my answer to all the other questions. And that's about it. I hope you're all having an awesome week. Bye.